Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Sheila Srinivas. I'm an ENT surgeon and head of department of ENT and head and neck surgery at Kaveri Hospitals, Bangalore. I have a 20 years of experience in the ENT field. At Kaveri Hospitals, we provide a range of services for adults and pediatric ENT problems. However, today I would like to speak to you about two main procedures in which we have an expertise. The first procedure I would like to talk to you is ear surgeries and cochlear implantation. Cochlear implantation is a surgery which is a boon for individuals who are born deaf, who have lost their hearing later in their lives and cannot be habilitated with hearing aid. So these individuals were initially uh, labeled as deaf and mute. However, now we can provide them hearing by doing a surgery called cochlear implantation. The next thing I want to talk to you about cochlear implantation in children because it is a life-saving procedure. A child who is born deaf had no future and would go to deaf school. Now we do implantation and we mainstream them. We send to them to normal school. Another procedure which we are here to talk about today is about endoscopic ear surgeries. Endoscopic ear surgeries have been a new thing in the field. However, it avoids an incision behind the ear as well as the time of healing and going back to work is also faster. The use of endoscopes in ENT have been very vast. We are using endoscopes for our nose, sinuses, base of the skull. I'm a skull base ENT surgeon. So we go up to the pituitary and do a lot of skull base procedures with endoscopes. And let's not forget the use of endoscopes in ENT, which is the silo endoscopy. Now we have fine endoscopes, hair-like endoscopes, which can enter our salivary glands, which are there at the floor of the mouth and inside, which can also be treated, avoiding an open surgery over the face and having various other benefits. So here I am welcoming you to our ENT department at Kaveri, Bangalore.